everybody, this is Missy Nelson, director with 31 Gifts, and I'm walking through my apps that I use in my business on a daily basis on my cell phone, and the next one that we're gonna talk about is the My Consultant app, and that app is over here on the left-hand side of my screen. The My Consultant app is amazing. It's a two-in-one app that is a calculator and is also a mileage tracker. Now, I don't believe that this app is free. I think I paid, it was under five bucks, and it's a one-time fee, and I'm gonna use it forever. And that's a tax deduction if I purchase it, so that's awesome too. So let's go um, into the My Consultant app. First, I'm gonna show you what it looks like in the Play Store so that when you go to look it up. So this is what it looks like in the Play Store, My Consultant. And I don't know what the price is because I've already um, downloaded it. It could have been free or it was like $4.99 or $2.99 or something awesome. So let's go into the app now and see what this app does for your business to save you time. So the first option is my calculator. The second option is my mileage. So let's start at the bottom here where it says my mileage. So we're going to enter, click on that. And whenever you get into the car, now I'm going to start using this. I just found it in my phone. I didn't realize that the My Consultant app also had a mileage tracker. I had always been using it as my calculator at my parties. Um, but I think that I'm going to start using this to track my miles because be because I don't have to click the odometer every time I get in the car, the trip odometer. So say I go to drop off a hostess packet, I'm going to click on the plus sign here to add a new trip. The purpose is dropped off hostess packets to Mary Ronalds. And then I'm gonna click on start odometer and I'm gonna put what the odometer was um, when I started the trip. So whatever my car odometer reading is, I'm gonna enter that in here. That's 52,000, let's just say. And then the end odometer reading. So when you get home, your end odometer reading is going to be, let's say, oh, I don't know, how far do we drive? Uh, 52, oh, 10, we drove 10 miles. I'm gonna click enter and 10 miles. It automatically calculated calculated the trip for me. So yeah, hello, this is amazing. Um, my purpose is in there, the start odometer, the end odometer, and the miles driven. That is awesome. No more going to Google Maps, figuring out how many miles it was between the two destination, the two different places, home and the destination ever again. So then I'm just going to click save. Oh, it also has the date. This is amazing. So click save and it enters it in Oh, it didn't put it in there. What happened? I wonder. Huh. Let's try that again. I think I think because my phone um let's try this again. I think it's cuz my phone went blank for a second. It kind of washed it out. Let's just make sure that this app actually works. Okay. There's that 10 miles driven. Click save. Oh, there it is. So it's just cuz my phone I hadn't touched my phone screen, so it went blank, but there it is, you guys. Dropped off hostess packet to Mary. I went 10 miles, and it added it to my 100 miles that I already had in there. And if I ever want to go back and click on it, I can go back and see what the purpose was. So, yeah, this is pretty sweet. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use that, I think. All right, well, let's go back in and look at my calculator. This is what I use all the time, every single day. I use this calculator mainly at my home shows because... It takes me forever to check somebody out already, and um, now I can speed up that process and get to the next person who is waiting for me. So uh, all you have to do with this is it automatically calculates your shipping and tax. What you have to do is you have to click on item subtotal at the very top and enter her items. So maybe she got a $35 zip top organizing utility tote. She also got $7 worth of personalization and a half price purse because purses are half price this month. So she got her purse for $22.50. Okay, so all of her items are added in there. The subtotal is $64.50. I'm gonna click done on the top. $64.50, it automatically did shipping and that is 8%. $5.16. It automatically did the sales tax, which is $5.57. Now, my grand total is $75.23. What if she wants this direct shipped or it's a retail order? I can go in and click add additional shipping and type in four 
and it will automatically add it up and add four dollars to the grand total. The tax will change. The shipping will the tax will change because it's taxed on the shipping. So now my grand total is seventy nine fifty five. And this is what I do at the party. If I am at home and a hostess messages me a subtotal for one of her orders and she doesn't know how to figure it out or she's having a hard time calculating it, all you have to do is do a screenshot of your screen. Isn't that cool? So I'm going to do a screenshot. Boom. I did saving screenshot to my to my phone and then I'm going to go over to my messenger and I'm going to send her the screenshot of the order. Boom. That is how long it took me to send her a total. Seriously. Amazing. So now she has an image of what I screenshotted. She has a breakdown, not only the item subtotal, the shipping, the additional shipping, the sales tax and the grand total. So she has everything that she needs to fill in that order form properly. So ladies and gents, that is my consultant. Go ahead and talk to your ladies. Talk to you later.